Welcome to Conversations with Dupree. Thank you for tuning in. If this is your first time, I want to thank you for coming in and listening. And if it's your first time, subscribe to Dupree Shamir on social therapy on Twitter. You follow Dupree Shamir on Twitter and also follow Social Therapy One on Twitter and subscribe to Social Therapy Mag on YouTube. Thank y'all guys for tuning in. Today, you know, today we're going to touch on stocks versus Bitcoin. Now, you know, nowadays the, the cryptocurrency is very popular now. And a lot of people is, you know, going to Bitcoins and investing in Bitcoins. And some people are still doing it the old traditional way with stocks. Now, then my, then my, I want to ask you a question. Have you ever invested in stocks or are you investing in Bitcoins, cryptocurrency? Now, I think with stocks is it's important if you want to get into stocks, you want to know what are you investing in the companies that are, are booming, you know, since, you know, the pandemic has kind of going up and down, you know, people are trying to get back to their normal life. But I think is uh, if you want to start, you know, getting into stocks, you might want to definitely want to start getting into companies that are, that's definitely, you know, making money. And you can kind of see a big return down the line. You know, I will say, you know, you start off small first. Learn, learn about the stocks, learn about Wall Street. You know, put your money in places where you're not going to lose money. You know, uh, I think it's important to just basically just take your time. And also, you know, put, put money away. For, for your children, you know, if you start them young to, to learn about the stocks, you know, you, we got the, the mutual funds and you have the CDs as well. And also the IRAs as well. You want to be able to kind of invest, spread your eggs in different baskets. But right now, you know, the cryptocurrency is what's popular now. Are we going into... A new wave in a new world. Are we going to new things as far as cryptocurrency? Will a dollar be no longer being used in society in America and all across the world? Will we be definitely everything would be like numbers digital? Is that possible? And I say there there is a, a, a higher chance possible a possibility that we are heading into the cryptocurrency era where everything is be digital with the technology the way things is now we were so used to uh spending with money paper money where that be no longer needed so i see that from stocks versus cryptocurrency stocks versus bitcoins bitcoins is very popular now in American culture, popular culture, you know. So I'll, I'll say that um, the, here's the question, too. Do you think that you'll be able to buy property down the line with cryptocurrency? Have that ever crossed your mind? Will you, be able to, will you be able to buy a car? Will you be able to get a mortgage, get a home with cryptocurrency? You know, um, that's that's something where it seemed like society is headed as far as um, you no longer will need money. You will just have to have like like a credit card. You don't know, see how you have the credit and the cash value. Um, that seemed like that's where it's going to be going. Like it's just going to be a digital number game where, you know, whatever you whatever you accumulate it, whatever you make, whatever is. 5,000, 3,000, it's going to be in digital crypto. You have to just, you know, use it as far as like a credit card. This be no more withdrawing cash from ATM machines. This is my opinion. Just, just right now, this is my opinion. But it seemed like with technology, we may be headed that way. 
Now, I could be wrong. You know, so I don't want y'all guys to take what I say um, for truth. But it's, it's a possibility because, you know, everything with technology, the advance with everything, you know, um, it's important that, you know, you understand where we're going, where we've been and where we're going from here. So when we when they say stocks versus Bitcoin, you want to ask yourself questions. How long will stocks be here forever? Or will cryptocurrency take over stocks? That's something to think about. That's really something to think about. You know, um, there's people who are so well knowledge when it comes to uh, the, the stocks. You know, Wall Street. You know, I say just do your research. If you want to get into, you know, uh, stocks or, you know, Bitcoin. You, you definitely want to uh, do your research first before you put your money out. It's very it's very important to, to get knowledge first, to study and read and have, an, have a better understanding before you rush into something and you regret. Yeah, so I think that um, a lot of people in, you know, a popular culture, a lot of people is really starting to you know, hear more about cryptocurrency. And, you know, does it have does it have a, a good and bad in it? It makes you wonder it will it be a good and bad in the Bitcoin that you that you invest in right now. You know, is it risky? Is it almost similar like the stocks? That's questions you always want to ask yourself. What is more safer? Is it safer just to invest in stocks? Is it safer now that just now? The cryptocurrency error that may be moving in that direction, people will move into that direction with Bitcoins. Or do you feel safe with just having a CD or mutual funds, you know, or bonds or would you be, you know, or your IRAs? So it's those are questions you want to ask yourself, you know, will be more safer for me and my family. You know, whether you're married, whether you're single, or whatever the case may be, you have children. You have to ask yourself these questions. Which one is safe? And I say that, um, you know, do the research first, like always. And um, when you when you do your research, you will have a better understanding of what are you putting your money into. I think investments is very, very important. You know, in this day and this day and age, you know, it's, it's very important because your 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 revenue stream is working for you. You know, you definitely try to, you know, keep continuing the revenue and you spreading your eggs in different baskets and you invest in whether it's property, investing in gold, silver, you know, stocks in a cryptocurrency you know, Bitcoin, you know, I have not invested in Bitcoins. So I'm still in in the stages of, you know, kind of like wondering what is it, you know, we wonder, is it is a phase for now? Will it last? Or this is something that we we better get used to. So there's things you need to think about when it comes to the financial world. And what you're trying to do, you're trying to build uh, wealth for your family so you can enjoy the fruitful labors of this this, this planet. So it's, it's important to, to know the different options out there. If you're not sure, if you're not sure um, when it comes to the stocks, you know, reach out to different, different ones. It's a different, different stocks uh, companies out there. Get with a, a financial advisor, get with a business consultant where we can sit down with you and discuss, you know, your options. So when it comes to stocks versus Bitcoins, there's always going to be something that you're going to want to you want to know. Is it worth still putting money in stocks? Is it worth still putting money into Bitcoins? Will cryptocurrency take over the world? Those are questions you need to ask yourself today. You know, why are you on your lunch break? 
or why you still at work or why you relaxing today listening to this podcast conversation with Dupree. This is a hope that I gave some little bit of uh, education, uh, some information that could be valuable to you and your family, friends, loved ones. And I thank you so much for tuning in to Conversations with Dupree. Make sure you subscribe to Social Therapy Mag on YouTube. And again, make sure you follow Social Therapy One on Twitter. Follow Dupree Shamir on Twitter. And also make sure to follow Pretty Candles, P-R-E-E-T-Y Candles on Instagram and also Facebook. And yes, we are also definitely doing advertisement, great rates, advertisements at nineteen ninety nine. You promote, we promote your brand twice a day on Instagram, and also we do a commercial for you on YouTube. For nineteen ninety nine for one month, you can't beat that. And your video will always be on Social Therapy Mag. Your commercial, and thank you, and thank you so much for tuning in. We look forward, look forward to talking with you guys next Tuesday noon time. Until then, be safe, enjoy your day. And spread wisdom and love to everyone. Have a good one.